What's up YouTube? You checking out the frequent flyer? And as you guys can see, we have this thing to check out. Courtesy of Gear Best. Let's get right in here and open it up. Check this thing out. Got the quad right here. We're gonna sit that to the side. Pull all the other accessories out first. So this wow, this translator looks very interesting. So I'm guessing that you're supposed to put your tablet or phone in the middle of this thing. Fly FPV, Wi-Fi FPV, unfortunately. I have no idea what this thing is. <laughs> Set that off to the side. We'll move this out the way. We have some prop guards here. It's a set of spare props. That seems to be taped to the inside of the box. Along with this USB charging cable taped to the inside of the box. And underneath everything, we have the instructions manual. Little booklet. Explain how to set this thing up probably. Most likely. And let's try to free this quad from here. Looks like I might need the blue alien. Little zip ties on here. Some plastic on it. Oh. Plastic off it. Okay, so here's the quad here. Different design, I can see that. Looks like the on and off button is here on the top. Let's see, this is a proprietary battery. Oh, hope I didn't break it. <laughs> so this is the battery here. So I guess you have to push this thing in, this little button here, in order to get the battery out. That thing is hard to pull out. Yeah, you have to push this little button in. To release the battery I almost broke the thing and so I have no idea what goes in here in the front actually probably this thing here which looks empty so I doubt if it actually does anything I think this is just to fill it because um, this thing does have a this thing does have a, a obstacle avoidance module that you can add to this thing. You have to purchase it separately though. I do not have the obstacle avoidance module, <laughs> but we're definitely going to check this thing out, see how it flies. Let's see, this is the on and off button there. Lately, these companies have been getting fancy with these things and having push buttons uh, to turn it on. And the first one that I saw was the Holy Stone uh, quadcopter. I forget which one it was. I guess it's, I think it was the 300 um, dash one. Anyhow, this thing has blue lights in the front, red in the rear. They got that part right. And hmm, this thing, not bad. It, it looks kind of awesome, I think. So we're definitely going to check this thing out. We're going to take it through its paces. And we're definitely going to have a night fix with it. And a morning fix, maybe a quick review, or ultimately a full review. Thanks for watching.